Hey there. You must be the new guy Emir mentioned. Welcome to the Watch. So, what's your name? And why are you even here? Well... The name's Noah. As for being here, the world's a big place. I want to see as much as I can. <laughs> yup, I'm the same. We're two peas in a pod. I left my village because I heard something big was happening out here in the world. I mean, I didn't know where it was happening, so I just started running. And right as my legs were ready to snap, I ended up here. Name's Leon, by the way. I'm sort of an old hand around this place, so if you've got questions, fire away. You've been here two days. Come on, Mimi, have a girl's back. I'm Gar. No one's been warming this post longer than me, which ain't really saying much. The Watch are basically mercs with public backing and we get slapped with every kind of job. Some folks stay, some folks leave. Don't know if you're a stayer or a leaver, but we'll see what you can do in the meantime. I am Mio of the East Reach. Welcome. Or boss, if that's easier. So, did I hear right that we're teaming up with the Empire Gar? I can't believe we're gonna be working with a bunch of imps! I know the League and Empire ain't got much in the way of rosy history, but I guess this is some kind of goodwill gesture. All above my pay grade, but I know this much. When a politician shows you something with one hand, it's the other one you gotta keep an eye on. Still, a job's a job. They set up a command post on the hill there at the Elder's residence. You ready for your first assignment? You got this, kiddo. Just keep it loose. It's also your first assignment. the last of the arrangements. Gesture of Amity, my hide. Those prune-faced mules on the council just wanted to saddle me with the grunt work. I'm going to make them pay for it when we get home, mark my words. Will we be returning to Norrister straight away, milady? I thought perhaps we might rest a spell. A few more days of this balmy weather would not go amiss. Uh, additionally, I've heard tell of a local herb chicken dish that simply melts on the tongue. We don't have time for that! Why do they keep pushing me down? Ugh. Well, so be it. If I have to put in double or triple the effort to make them respect me, then that's what I'll do! <sighs> Now let's go. Um... You're with the watch, yes? Good, good. As you may be aware, we need leverage to negotiate with the Empire, which means we must pull our weight on this little co-expedition. I don't expect you to find a primal lens, but if you locate the rune barrows, I'll see you're paid extra. Jingle jingle and all that, yes? 
Now get out there and show me some results. Dazzle me, handsome. Uh, sorry? Jane Quiss, we are leaving. Uh, very good, milady. Oh, and see if we can get that herbed chicken to go. <sighs> well, that was a thing. That was our new boss, Lady Periel, head of house groom. Her land, her rules. She sure took a shine to old Noah here. Lucky you, making a good first impression. I did what now? We're here. Remember, this is a co-expedition with the Empire, which means we'll be paired with Imperial officers. Best behavior, all of you. Especially you, Leanne. Sure thing! Wait, why did he call me out? The League's operatives will be here soon, sir. I believe everything is in order. Thank you, Hildy. So what do you make of this co-expedition? I welcome the exchange of olive branches, sir. A soldier's greatest wish is to not be working, after all. Just so. Let us hope the olive branches are genuine. Looks like we found our officers. I take it you are the delegation from the League of Nations? Welcome. You come well recommended. I'm Lieutenant Sane Kessling of Galdia's First Imperial Army. I'll be leading one team on the co-expedition. Awful young to be a lieutenant, ain't you? <laughs> you some noble kid? Is it your job to pry into my lineage, good Lycan? Guess not. Noted. I am Hildy, Lieutenant Kessling's aide. The objective of this operation is to locate the rune barrows that were recently discovered in the forest. Uh, sorry, question. Why do we have to find something that's already been discovered? A local stumbled upon the ruins while lost in the forest. And while he provided physical evidence of the find... He got lost again on the way back? Correct. Our search team has been assigned the area north of here, through the forest. Unfortunately, we don't know the lay of the land, hence the joint effort. Don't worry, lady! We'll handle the navigating! I've been preparing two whole days for this, <laughs> yep! <sighs> We're prepared to leave at once. Is this agreeable to you? Makes sense. We'd head in first, so the rest of your team knows where to go. Come on, then. Let's get this show on the road. Are you not with them? Huh? Oh, yeah, I am. Sorry. Um, name's Noah, by the way. Nice to meet you. Likewise. Well, if you're coming, keep up. To review, 
Our objective is to traverse the northern forest and pinpoint the location of the rune barrows. Is that clear? Crystal, ma'am. Pretty sure this is the forest we're looking for, Lieutenant. Keep moving. We've no time to waste. Is it just me, or is he kind of a jerk? <sighs> Why can't he be a sweet little angel like our Noah here? Less talk, more walk. Ready to intercept. Not 
like this. You son of a... The rest that is in it. your hands. Well, this complicates things. Uh, I don't know a quick way around, and there's no way we'll move this ourselves. Guess we'll need to back off until we get reinforcements. Step aside, please. Huh? What are you... Whoa! Was that magic? No. It felt different. The Empire has been studying ways to amplify the power of a rune lens by channeling it through a device called a regule. Oh, that's incredible! I, I wish mine could do that. You've got a lens, Noah? Oh, well, ladies and gentle wolves, so do I. Rub-a-dub-dub, -dub, don't be a flub! <sighs> there! Did you see the glint? My power is usually focused in my hand, but I can't seem to redirect it as magic. A lens's power conforms to a wielder's talent. Yours is merely doing what you need it to. So everyone here's got a lens? <sighs> what about you, Hildy? In a manner of speaking. Hmm, <sighs> nice. That regular contraption is pretty impressive. Are... Dunno. More importantly, where are you from, Noah? A small village up in the mountains. <sighs> Were your folks okay with you joining the Watch? Cause uh, mine sure weren't having it. My parents are dead, actually. Oh, sorry. It's all right. The other villagers are like family to me, especially Aunt Martha. And she really didn't want me to go. If you all don't mind, we need to carry on.
bombs! What you get? Does this mean I'm promoted? Huh. What is this? Some sort of shrine, though the design is unfamiliar. We're not alone. Stay alert, and keep moving. There goes my plan to stop for a picnic. Exercise. Huh? How did we? I smell a mystery afoot, kiddo! Something's here. Weapons up, everyone. We got company. Where? I can't see it. Up there! Above us! Let's do this! Ah! 
What was that? A forest eater? They cause plenty of trouble around my village, too. Good thing you brought us. We're skilled, and we know what we're talking about. Yes. Um, thank you, Good Lycan. I have a name. It's Gar. As you wish, Master Gar. When you say it, it sounds so sarcastic. Uh, fine. Call me Mio. Okay, hang on. Did we really never do introductions? In that case, I'm Leon. I saw you checking out my moves during the fight. Pretty snazzy, eh? Yes, they were... hard to miss. Uh, yup, sure were. Well, spread the word when you get back to Galdia. I want everyone to know about the butt-kicking Supergirl you met. <laughs> <laughs> I owe you thanks as well, Noah. Huh. Just count yourself lucky we spotted it first. Anyway, are we ready to move on? No, you can't. Stop trying to hog the spotlight, new guy. What is... What'd you do, Noah? The mist is clearing. It and the shrines must be linked. A trap designed to protect the barrows. I've read reports of such mechanisms. So can we get through now?
look at that. It must be part of the rune barrows. We hit pay dirt. Maybe our rune lens has guided us. Let's press on. incident. Somebody's smiling on you today, Lieutenant. See? I told you guys! Pay dirt with a capital P! Yes, but the entrance is closed. Not a problem, so long as the ruins still hold life. Barrows and lenses are closely intertwined, although some of the more neglected ruins no longer respond. So, this is the end, right? Mission accomplished and all that? Not until we know if these are the correct barrows. What do you mean? Our true objective is a special caliber of rune lens known as a primal lens. The mere possibility of finding one is why so many resources have been... Uh, hey, yeah! I, I think the Yelly Lady in Aronside mentioned something about that. Is this primal lens so different from the ones we have? Indeed. They are priceless. Only a handful have ever been discovered. Well, there's only one way to find out if it's here. <sighs> Where is your sense of caution? Look, I want to know what's inside. I mean, I bet there's all kinds of wonders I've never beholded. Behelded? <laughs> Fair enough. Then it's agreed we'll explore inside. Good. Get a look at this place. It seems promising. Over there. What's that? 
Is it the primal lens? Pretend it is. What do you get out of this? Fame and fortune? Let's just say it would be a stunning accomplishment. Does anyone see a way to reach it? Well, we came this far. Let's sniff around. another one of those gate things. Back up, folks. I'll handle this one. Rub-a-dub-dub. -dub. Open, you schlub. Uh, hey, this one's broken. Open, you dumb door. I think it's more like... What? Okay, now the new guy is seriously overstepping. Sorry, boss. Can't help it if I'm a natural. <laughs> I love it. Now, come on. Are we locked in? Either someone truly wants us here, or they truly do not. Exercise. I feel stronger. We activated something. This place is amazing. So, what's with the pictures? They must mean something. I think the wind changed direction too. Perhaps there are new places to explore. We should search for Yes, you did it! Your 
are such a good widow, Noah. Yes, you are. Uh, <laughs> uh, thanks, Leanne. <laughs> Holy crap! The lieutenant laughed. You okay? Did it hurt? You must have imagined it. Come on. What do you think? End of the line? Let's do a sweep. Hmm, it looks like a dead end to me. Same. Well, we'll just have to... Huh? Look out! Floor caved in. Can you see what's going on up there? We must have fallen a ways, because no one is answering. Yeah, I can barely make out the ceiling. Crazy that I'm not hurt. You okay? I am, surprisingly. But don't ask me how or why, because I remember none of it. Guess we just got lucky. Well, we'd better go find the others. I looked around while you were unconscious. The exit is blocked by rubble. We'll have to wait for the others to come to us. So, um... Sane. Sane Kessling. Right. Sane. Gotta say, kinda stings that the Pride of the Empire doesn't look a whole lot older than me. The Empire may indeed consider the House of Kessling a source of pride. 
but I've yet to earn that pride myself. And what of you? How did you end up enlisting? Enlisting? Oh, joining the Watch? Uh, well, once I left home, I felt like I had to, I don't know, do something. Joining the Watch felt like a good start. And what is it you wish to do, then? Good question. Uh, I guess I just want to help people, if I can. My sister Lean calls me a meddler. And as much as I hate to say it, she's not wrong. So I suppose I want to find out what's so wrong with meddling. A meddler who doubts the merits of meddling. <laughs> nah, I shouldn't have told you that. But I'm glad you did. And worry not. I'm certain that faith in your meddlesome nature will see it become your strength, if it hasn't already. A suggestion, though, if I may be so bold. Return home for your sister's sake as much as your own. Uh, what's that supposed to mean? I found myself taken by a premonition upon hearing news of this primal lens. And now, having looked upon it with my own eyes, I am fearful of it all the more. A new age of conflict may be upon us, Noah. The Empire and the League of Nations at war. At war? Kinda out of nowhere, don't you think? We're here working together now, aren't we? We are. But at the machinations of one Duke's Aldrich, a man utterly entranced by these rune lenses. He wishes to acquire them, and has shown himself willing to mobilize his military to do so. That he is capable of convincing other nations to do the same is... ominous. He is a formidable man, and with the regules he has the means to use the lenses as tools of war. Even the primal lens, should he so desire. And few are those who can control their desire in the face of power such as that. Uh... And if you're right, and this war comes to pass, what then? I will do what must be done, as a Kessling must. The misgivings of one man are not reason enough to besmirch the good name of a noble house. Is that so? Well, if the time comes, I guess I'll... What was that? Over there, I see light. Some of the rubble fell away, but why? No idea, and I don't really care so long as it leads to a way out. Noah? I hear it. We've got company. Two arms! Your 
you're done! That's what you get! We're on our own until help finds us. We must take caution. Look out! Let's do this! Sing! Look out! Thanks, Noah! That's what you get! Thank you. Also, I see now that you... About what? Throwing yourself in front of me like that was meddlesome indeed. <laughs> well, you're still welcome. Let's do this! It's like a way up. Come on. I bet the others are searching somewhere around here. These comrades of yours must be reliable indeed to worry so. Oh, definitely. I mean, I just met them today, but we're still rock solid. What? Never mind. I forgot who I was speaking to. Your aide must be beside herself. Hildy, was it? Oh, I'm sure she's handling it just fine. Either way, I agree we can't stay here. Lead the way, Noah. Say, Noah, I've been thinking. Yeah? 
We could probably fight more effectively if we timed our attacks better. Why don't I use my rune lens just as you strike the enemy? Worth a try. Sure, let's give it a shot. Ah, and here comes a chance to practice right now. Let's do this! I've got this! Now! By the rune power! Nothing to worry about. It worked. Told ya. Did you now? Yep. I mean, it was your idea, so I trusted you knew how to pull it off. <laughs> and bam! I was right! That simple, was it? <laughs> well, if you say so. Do this. You're done. That's what you get. I feel stronger. Right, that should do it. Let's move. Let's do this! What you get? There. It's open.
We're back where we started. Uh, but the light's different. Look, it's the primal lens. Did it activate? Don't ask me. So this is it, right? Did we find... Look sharp! It's protecting the barrows! You ready, Sam? I've got this! Now! By the rune power! We're no match for it! Run, Sane! I'll hold it off! Don't be a fool! I'm in command here, it should be me who stays! I can't let you do that! You've got a big future ahead of you! As to you! Weapons up, boys. Stand your ground. Y yes ma'am! What are you doing here? Little early to be calling a retreat, Lieutenant. The cavalry has arrived. Are you all right, Lieutenant? Hey, kiddo. Hey, blondie. Which one of you ordered a hero? Cause she's here! A hero? Hero when? She hero? Uh, whatever. Arm up! We'll show this monster that flesh and blood are more powerful than stone! Ready to teach this thing a lesson, Sane? I'm ready! Next. 
like this. My turn! Whoa! That was close! This place is falling apart! Anything can happen on the battlefield. If you want to survive, be ready to adapt. Damn right! Take what you're thrown and turn it to your advantage. Mercs don't have to play it by the book. Wise words. I'll have to remember that. Take what you're thrown. Maybe we could use the rubble to take cover. Something's happening. Take cover. like that. Normal defenses won't protect us. Got him. <laughs> you sure it's a he? That was a rune golem. They've been sighted before at other barrows. Mother load, huh? I know folks say rune lenses are condensed magic, but I don't know what this is. Imagine wielding it. No, it's likely too much for one person to contain. There's your mission accomplished, Leanne. We have what we came for. And I am so dang happy. I mean, I had my doubts about the League and Empire working together and stuff, but we pulled it off, <laughs> yep. She's right. This victory belongs to all of us. Well said. This discovery is a symbol of newfound friendship between the Empire and the League. Let us remember it always.
Then we are agreed. The disputed Norse Faurian territory will be ceded to the Empire. In return, the Empire will pay annual compensation to the League Council for a period of ten years. Done! I welcome this graceful solution to another of our long-standing problems. This is truly a joyous day, gentlemen. On behalf of the League and the monarchy of Norrister, I praise you for your tireless work, Dukes. You have Eucris's thanks as well. How marvelous that peace between us will be sustained. Unless the esteemed General Goldwyn plans to hang up his uniform, I wouldn't dream of quarreling with the Empire. Nor I with you, King Valmoris. We all know the ferocity of Kanani warriors, and I fear I would be outmatched. Hear, hear. Today's meeting has been an excellent demonstration of what we might accomplish together. If I may, Dukes Aldrich. Hmm? Groom's daughter, was it? Periel Groom, Your Grace. Such an honor to meet you. Ariel, you're, uh, you're an adjunct, so you're only here to facilitate. Quite so. And as such, I would like to facilitate a discussion about why, after giving the Galdian Empire the primal lens we found half a year ago, we've received no reports as to how the research is progressing. And perhaps I might also facilitate an explanation as to why they haven't paid their share of the costs. <laughs> I'd heard that Count Groom's heir was sharp as attack and twice as prickly. And I see the rumors are true. My apologies, Miss Groom. The primal lens is a rare artifact. Even the Empire has never seen its like. As such, its study is taking longer than we initially anticipated. However, you have my assurances that we will respect your contributions and share our findings as soon as possible. I will also ensure you receive payment by the time you depart. I believe you're staying with us a few days longer. Indeed, Your Grace. It's a beautiful city, and I was hoping to explore it. Also, it's Countess Groom, not Miss. Uh, Ariel! No! <laughs> My deepest apologies, dear Countess. I pray you enjoy the rest of your stay in Galdea. Please, don't ever do that again, milady. Oh, thought my heart might stop. They asked me to facilitate. I facilitated. You demanded, milady, and to Dukes Aldric, no less. The man whose influence in the Empire is surpassed only by the Emperor himself. I'm well aware, Jenquis. I simply don't like the man. What do you mean? The Dukes has gone out of his way to make peace with us. That Norsefaria purchase gives him Fort Atlas, which is the perfect foothold for invading League lands. And he got it for a song, especially when compared to taking it the hard way. Also... Oh, 
How so? I can't stand his smug face. Oh, anyway, enough of that. We're going out tonight. So long as I'm here, I intend to sample Galdia's finest. Very good, milady. I hear tell of a regional speciality where they melt the cheese just so, and... Hey, new guy. Getting used to the watch? Uh, <laughs> I've been at it for half a year. Two days less than you, remember? Ha, what a kidder! Anyway, I'm gonna head over to the mess hall. Not like we got anything better to do these days. Well, she never changes. Oh? <laughs> Some... Noah, perfect timing. Gotta talk to you. What is it? As I'm sure you know, the watch's got a pretty high turnover. People come, people go, and they all got their reasons. Heck, even Mimi took off. Went south to you, Chris, on some kind of warrior journey or whatever. That's why I want you to take my place as captain for a while. While I'm not planning to up and vanish anytime soon, I think it'd be good practice. Yeah, it'll be good. Wait, what? You're making Noah the acting captain? I've got seniority by two days. You should have asked me. I did ask you. You said, and I quote, that sounds like a pain in the butt. Mm, yep, that sounds like me, all right. Fine then, Noah, I officially dubbed thee acting captain. Well, Noah, what you say? Sure, I'll do it. See? Decisive. That's what I like about you. Now for your first assignment, let's go tell Emir what's going on. Need something? I'm gonna be letting Noah take over as captain for a while. 
You would do that to me. Did it ever occur to you that I might have my own plans for how to allocate our resources? Why it's my job to create order out of this shoddy ragtag outfit is beyond me. I'd quit on the spot if it weren't for her ladyship. Hey, it is what it is. Going forward, Noah chooses our teams. And if you catch wind of any jobs, you set him up. Jobs? Oh, there's no shortage of those. I thought the Watch was created as a reserve force to assist the standing army in times of crisis, but it seems I was mistaken. Because the rest of the land clearly sees us as some kind of glorified errand runners. Ah, oh, why me? Why? Why? Right then. What sort of job would please the Watch's finest? Tiger hunting! Not listed. Wolf hunting! Anything related to hunting. Not listed. However, the watch is shorthanded. If you meet anyone gullible enough, <laughs> capable enough, then kindly recruit them. Can I trust you with that, oh great captain? Just Noah is fine. Don't let me down, oh mighty captain. If you bring home recruits, I'll consider letting you thicken out your team. In the meantime, I can't spare anyone. Count me in! We'll show them what the watch is made of! Thank you. 
Greetings. I've got a number of pelts for sale today. Can I interest you? Uh... You know, I don't think we've met before. The name's Kuroto, and I'm a hunter by trade. This year, Crossbow's been my partner for longer than I care to remember. Together, we can snipe with more accuracy than any elf. That's quite a claim. Wait, yeah, I smell it now. You're trying to achieve something great, aren't you? Uh... I've been at this for a long time, and it's given me a keen sense of smell. There's not much that gets past me. The truth is, I'm seeking new companions to fight in my side. Of course you are. And here's the part where you tried to win me over, right? Another tried before, years ago. But if you're thinking to impress me with a show of prowess, think again. There's not a man or woman alive who can match me with a crossbow. Let's say I wanted to impress you anyway. Hmm. If you're that determined, you must have a good reason. How's this? Hunt me three wild boars. You'll find some in Redthroat Ridge to the east. You finished your hunt already? Ah, but you haven't bagged enough of them, have you? Was I not clear? If you think you can impress me, hunt down three wild boars in Redthroat Ridge to the east. Do this! Stop resisting, bandit! For the last time, I'm not a bandit! I'm a desperado! It's the same thing. Damn it! I didn't attack your stupid village! It's true! I came from a place where you rode your bronc like the wind, and sometimes you did bad stuff. But I'm done with that life!
What's going on here? Nothing that concerns you, bub. So unless you want to get dragged into this, I suggest you keep walking. Yeah, I don't think I can do that. Why is this guy under suspicion? Are you kidding me? Look at how he's dressed! He couldn't be any more suspicious! Oh yeah, great sleuthing, Inspector Dumbface! I wear these duds because they were a gift from my desperado brothers. I'd rather die than change out of them! It does seem like you're accusing him based on how he looks. I'm not taking any chances. Bandits have been raiding our villages near the Imperial border. Didn't you hear? He's not a bandit. He's a desperado. That's what I've been trying to tell these morons! Except they got nothing but cotton between their ears. Desperados have a code of honor. We don't raid villages. Do you mind if I take it from here? Who are you? I'm Noah, from the Eltis Vice Watch. Oh. You're one of her ladyships. Fine. If you're willing to take responsibility, then knock yourself out. What do you think you're doing? It's okay. You can trust me. You said you didn't attack the village, right? <laughs> Finally! Someone with ears! I don't know what's wrong with you that you defend this guy. If anything bad happens, it's on you. Yep, got it. On me. Don't make me regret this. Thanks for the save, man. You're one upstanding guy. This has got to be fate or something. What do you say you let me join up with you? I came here to do big things. And I mean big. Big in what way? Big in a big way? What kind of question is that? The name's Yusuke. You're looking at one of the world's future titans. We're gonna make waves together, boss. I just know it. Welcome to the ranks. See, this guy knows what he's talking about.
do this. Lens. Ah, we're done here. That's what you get. You want a piece of me? Step on up! Exercise. I'm a freaking legend. Let's do this!
last one! That's what you get! I just keep getting better! You want a piece of me? Step on up! Let's do this!
What a joke! I'm a freaking legend! Let's do this! Exercise. I feel stronger.
Any last words? His exercise. I'm a freaking legend. A piece of me? Step on up! You finished your hunt already? Oh, and you've done exactly as I asked. Wild boars are ferocious creatures. It takes a tough hunter to bring down even one. So does that mean... Let's you and me have a little talk first. I adore the children of this town. I enjoy watching them grow up, in an almost fatherly sort of way, I suppose. Day by day, inch by inch, they live, learn and grow. Just like how a seed sprouts, before one day it finally flowers. But I can smell it change, and not for the better. Uh. 
The wind carries the scent here from afar. I'd hoped that I was reading it wrong, but since we first spoke, I feel it with a certainty. Whatever threat is out there is going to come here. It will steal these children's chance to blossom. So I've decided to join you, and that is my reason why. We're happy to have you.
Fair enough. It's been too long. What in blazes are you doing back here, Sabine? Last I heard, you were off quelling some kind of rebellion in Kenan. <laughs> oh, it's quelled. Thought I'd come rest my bones here for a while in the meantime. The watch, your idea of resting your bones? Maybe. Or maybe I just smell opportunity. So, who's this? One of your men? You got a name? Noah. See here, Noah. When you've been a merc as long as me, all it takes is one look at a man's face to know if he's long for this world. Ain't looking good, kid. Huh? What's that supposed to mean? Sabine! <laughs> Forget it. Probably just the ale talking. Good men know life is precious, including their own. You be a good man, Noah. And who is that delightful lady? Sabine's an old friend. Nah, she'd laugh me out of the building for that. Let's call her an old something. As mercs go, she's long in the tooth. Probably too damn stubborn to die, honestly. Yep, I can definitely see that. Fair enough.
do this! What a joke!
Huh? You selling something? We're looking for capable people to join the Eltis Vice Watch. Yeah, I've heard that name all right. Got my own mission, though, so... A mission, is it? Cloaks, daggers, that sort of thing? Generally. Well then, how about this? I'll help you with your mission, and in turn, you can help me with mine. You are gonna help me. Buddy, you don't even know what the mission is. Could be I'm out for blood, looking to part innocent heads from quaking shoulders and all that. Mm, you don't seem the type. And that being the case, I don't see the harm in helping. Actually, most folks would say I'm exactly the type. Question is whether you're keener than some or stupider than most. Last chance. Next time I ask you to help, you're gonna be bound to it. If you say it's a vital mission, I trust you. <laughs> you're even nuttier than I thought, and I love it. Know what? I'll join you. My mission can wait. Something tells me I'm in for a wild ride if I stick with you. Lead the way, then. Off your fingers and start shoving them up where the sun don't shine! Huh? What? What was that? Huh? That's weird. Oh, good day to you, sir. I heard some. Really nasty shouting. Are you okay? Oh, heavens! Did you come to check on me? That is so incredibly sweet of you. What a kind heart you have. My name is Francesca. Might I inquire as to yours? I'm Noah, from The Watch. Well, I am just tickled to meet you, Noah. This is an auspicious encounter indeed. I don't suppose the Watch is looking for healers? I command quite potent restorative magic, if I may be so bold. That's her. That's the one I was telling you about. Gave the broad a compliment and she flipped her lid on me. That sweet little number? 
if you say so. Hey, sugar, you want to come along with us and help clear up a little misunderstanding you had with my friend? Don't worry, Buttercup. We ain't gonna hurt you. Wouldn't dream of it. <laughs> what do you guys want? Stand back, Francesca. I'll handle this. Oh, Noah! We've only just met, and you're willing to put yourself in danger for me? I don't know what to say. I'm sure anyone would do the same. Hmm. How I wish that were true. Since there does seem to be a misunderstanding, I believe it's best I clear it up. You're very gracious, Noah, but please, if I may? I can't let you leave with these men. Who knows what might happen? Oh, <laughs> I have some idea. You needn't worry about me. I'm a healer. Should things get heated, I have a gift for calming even the most agitated of hearts. Please, allow me to demonstrate. Don't make me go over there and break you, you gropey little pasty-faced pigeon-licking garbage breath punks! Go fall off the mother-forsaken map! Yeah! Yeep! Or does your friend have a chronic case of stupidity? Cause I'm pretty sure I told you to keep your hands out of my zone, yeah? Or did I break a your widow head here with my big, big words? I'll say it again. Real slow for you and your moron friends. I do not like you. I do not ever want to see you again. And if I do, you're dead. You hear me? Dead! Now get the hell out of my sight, maggots! <laughs> Going! So, Noah, where were we? Ah, oh, yes. I'm Francesca, and I would like to offer my healing magic to your cause, if it pleases you, of course. You have a place with us. Delighted to hear that. Thank you, Noah.
You back for a while, Gar? Emir's whinging again about how no one's ever around to help. What about you? He's sending me on recon up north. Says I work best unencumbered. North? How north? The Imp's border? I've got a bad feeling, Gar. Real bad. If you value your life, run while you can. Can't believe they're sending Sabine on recon. They really expect things to get that rough? Extra personnel to intercept here, here, and here. And we'll need surplus provisions. I really hope this is all just in her head. Emir. Hmm? Oh, how grand of you to show up. And where exactly have you wastrels been frittering away your time while I toil day and night? We've been working our butts off, buddy! I have orders for you, Gar. Not me. Noah here is acting captain for now. Ah, yes. Apologies, oh great captain. Um, just Noah is fine. You expect me to bother with names? When so many of the Watch come and go as they please, without so much as a courtesy notification to yours truly. Yes, well, your orders then. West of Altisvice is a village called Altfredin. They've complained of bandits in the area. You are to investigate, and if possible, put the bandits to rout. I consider yours the best team for this mission. Good luck, don't die, etc. We'll leave at once. What's this? Compliance? How refreshing. Just see it's done quickly if you'd be so kind. Why are you being so nice to him? As if there's something wrong with being nice? Right away! Some stress relief, perhaps.
Do come again. Hunting time! Um, where are we going again? West, the village of Alphadin. Let's get this show on the road! Must be from the watch. Very kind of you to arrive so quickly. Let me assemble the villagers. My name is Noah. I'm acting captain of this company. I hear you've got a bandit problem? Yes, that's right. Bless her ladyship for looking out for us. Raiding Alphadin and the neighboring villages, breaking our hunting traps, too. I was accosted on the way to market. They tore up my fields. I heard a merchant was attacked the next village over. Okay, so what do they look like? There were three of them. The one in charge had a beard. The fellow I saw was some creep in a hood. Someone told me the culprit was wearing pink and long sleeves. A trio of bearded men with pink hoods? That's some profile. Maybe you could give us some idea of where they're holed up. I heard they retreated west, but there's nothing out that way. Or perhaps there is. What do you mean? Southwest of here, this would have been ages ago, we once found the entrance to what we assumed was an old mine. We sealed the place up after some of the kids wandered in by mistake, but it's possible someone could have found it and opened it up again. On the one hand, it's our only lead. On the other hand, meh. Might as well see what we find. Which is potentially nothing. If so, we can scratch one possibility off the list, right? I guess. So how do we find this mine? We left a subtle marker near the entrance. I'll tell you what to look for.
Okay, we'll check it out. Thank you, brave members of the Watch. This is the place the Elder mentioned. Now we just gotta find that marker. What was that? What a day, General! What a find! Wildfowl? We should make a stew! <laughs> Once again, fortune smiles upon the mighty Kogan! You're amazing, General. I'll follow you till the end of days, and then some! Dad was take the foul from the trap. <laughs> now we return to our castle triumphant. Those are clearly the bandits we're looking for. Uh, okay. But are you sure? I mean, they do look suspicious. But we shouldn't jump to conclusions and stuff, right? Maybe let's tail them and see what happens. You think we can move this minecart? Hey, good thinking, kiddo! You do it! Want a piece of me? Step on up! Bring it on! Yeah! 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 Ah! Come 
on! So long! That's what you get! I like it! Want a piece of me? Step on up! Bring it on!
not even worth sullying my blade. Experience is strength! Oh, hello. Can I help you? What are you poking around here for? Don't you know there are monsters about? It's not safe. <laughs> oh, this is rich. I'm surprised you even spotted me. I tend to go pretty unnoticed. <laughs> but forgive me the moment of levity. The name's Hiro. I'm what you might call a merchant on the move. I peddle my wares from highest mountain to farthest sea. As for why I'm here, you caught me in the middle of foraging. And needless to say, I don't get many hellos in a place like this, let alone a conversation. That makes you most unusual. <laughs> um, okay. Well, in that case, sorry to bother you. Nonsense. I welcome the company. Even in broad daylight, people tend to give me a wide berth. I guess I don't always exude approachable. Clearly, we were meant to cross paths. What's your name? Noah. Noah? Doesn't the watch have a talented recruit by that name? Is that you? Am I talking to THE guy? If you're sharp enough to spot me, you must have a big future ahead. I'd be honored to have your patronage. Can I show you my wares? Sure, what have you got? I'm so glad you asked. Hey, need something? Stay prepared. All right, future big shot. I'll see you around. That's one impressive elevator. Hmm. Oh, I know what to do. Huh? Well, this is totally the right answer. I can feel it starting to give. 
maybe we need to put something heavier on the switch. We need to bring something heavy over. Maybe it was rusted or something. Could be. Let's press on. Let's do this. Do this. Bring it on. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. What? Damn it. Bring it on. Yeah. Come on. I'm finishing this. That's what you get.
Let's do this. Bring it on. Let's. Come on. Wow, looks like it's ready to give!
Let's hunt. A piece of me? Step on up! Light. We must be near an exit. Where does this thing even go? Wonder what's going on out there. Kind of ruins. Fortress, if I had to guess. Halt! Who dares trespass upon the sacred grounds of mighty General Kogan's castle? Sorry, who are you? What? 
I asked you first! Yeah, who are you? I am Noah. Oh, great captain of the watch. The hell? Wait, you like being called that? <laughs> the watch. Oh dear, that sounds really bad. Whatever. You don't control us. Pretty soon, General Kogan's gonna declare himself ruler of this whole land, and you can't do squat about it! Uh, Euthus, maybe ease back on the whole... We're the General's faithful army, and if you brigands want the castle, you'll have to take us on first! Or you can come quietly. And we can just talk this thing out. Oh, I'm not scared of you! If you're the watch, then you can watch me crush you! <laughs> oh, we're gonna die! Get ready for trouble! Better grit those teeth! I don't know who you high and mighty think. I will let you lay a finger on the general or on my pal Sappy. <laughs> Target first.
Oh, you'll pay for this. Zabi, I'm using the contraption. Not the contraption. <laughs> Are we sure it even works? Our super secret weapon. It's gonna squash you fools flatter than a grandma's backside. I'll feel like pain. <laughs> what the? How is that fair? It's some kind of cream. That can't be good. Attention to who goes first! Come on! 
Why are you making this so hard? Are you the ones who've been making trouble around Alfredton Village or not? We had no choice. If we didn't steal the vegetables and loot the traps, how could we feed them? We'll save you, General Kogan. Okay, uh, what? <sighs> well, this complicates things, but it doesn't explain why you attacked the merchant. We didn't! The General would never do such a thing! The villagers of Altfordin say you did? It must be someone else. A few months ago, we were living by the Imperial border. Then a bunch of scoundrels attacked and put us to heel. So we took refuge here. <clears throat> Come to think of it, these guys aren't wearing pink. Plus, I don't see hoods. Hoods? Those are the guys who chased us off! General Kogan hates hoods! <laughs> but the man who attacked us wore one. Great. We bagged the wrong bandits. I mean, they shouldn't be stealing, but if they got mouths to feed... <sighs> Do whatever you will with me, but please, spare the others. General, no! Take me instead! Or me! <laughs> so be it. Oh, splendid. I sent you to solve one of my problems, and instead you've multiplied them. But they were driven from their village. General Kogan was only stealing vegetables to help his people. Can't we share some of our provisions to help him and the refugees? Of all the meddling. Oh, her ladyship is going to scold my ear off for this. First of all, this Kogan, general or not, is going straight into a holding cell for the time being. Her ladyship is that gal we met in Aronside Village, right? Is she really that scary? No, but she has a soft spot for stories like theirs. If I cause so much as a single tear, she'll berate me as a cold-hearted cad. So very well. You win. I'll have a rescue team sent to the ruins. Meanwhile, the General will have to answer for his crimes against vegetables. Understood? Thanks, Ymir. Sorry for the trouble. See, but I know you're not. Oh, um... 
Oh, great Captain Noah. My friend. My cousin. Huh? I don't know how to repay you for looking after my people. Thank you, cousin. Thank you, thank you. Okay, take it easy there, champ. The great captain of the watch, sorry, Noah's just doing what he always does. And thank you, cousin Leon. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> We're just happy to help. With you, Leanne. Don't play dumb. They said you're going home. How could you? You swore we'd become legends of the watch together. Going home? Who said that? Well, it's news to me. Leanne's jumping to conclusions, as usual. Wait, really? Me? Noah ain't leaving for good. It's just a mission. Emir can fill you in. Some stress relief, perhaps. There you are, oh great captain. It's Noah. Oh great captain. I have a new mission for you. Already cleared it with Gar. You hail from the village of Kushiri, yes? Well, they've reported bandit trouble similar to Altverdin's. I would like you to investigate. Well, well, well. Look who's piling on the work. Admit it. You think Noah's super talented. I think he's the one most familiar with the roads. Well, there you have it. I would imagine you'd leap at this chance. You must be wondering how your friends at home are doing, huh? I suppose I haven't seen Lean in forever. Don't confuse this for a furlough. We've received all sorts of worrying reports, and I need you on your toes. Need I remind you about the Imperial Envoy? 
Now, decide who will be accompanying you. My turn. Sure thing. Perfect. You caught me when I was warmed up. You're safe in my hands. Once Noah tells us where to go. Kashiri is northwest of here, on the far side of the mountains. There's a pass west of Altridin. A landslide was blocking the road recently, but it should be clear by now. Go sit. Let's go embarrass Noah in front of his people. Our destination is northwest of here, through the mountains, west of Alfredin. We'll be there in Noah time! Oh man, I'm good. <laughs> Noah time, brilliant. What exactly are you implying, General Chapel? Frankly, Countess Groom, it is the opinion of the Goldean Empire that these disturbances near our border are of your manufacture. You want to pin that on me? Oh, this is clearly Duke's Eldrick talking. I learned about the bandits at the same time you did. The Dukes is deeply concerned by these attacks, and will tolerate no threat to the Imperial people. <laughs> Spare me! What is he really after? The Rune Barrows? Or another foothold like Norsefaria to aid his invasion of the League? <laughs> A wild accusation. We have witnesses who have seen members of the Eltis Vice watch inside our borders, and if you refuse to extradite them... You'll bring troops onto our lands? You are the one inventing a pretext for invasion, no matter how you try to pretty it up. This is a search for raiders. No more and no less. Once they are found, we will withdraw our troops. You have my word. Oh, do I now? How delightful. Even the most artless swindler would spin a more convincing lie.
village is on the other side of these mountains? Yeah. And since the soldiers are gone, that must mean they clear the landslide. Pretty steep around here. Watch your steps. my blade. I am grateful for any opportunity to grow. Challenge accepted. Resorting to violence. Okie doke. Get out of here. Wah. That doesn't even count as exercise.
do this. Now that we're over the mountains, Kashiri is just a little ways to the west. We're here to deal with the bandits, but we should still stop by Noah's village first. Not too much farther. We can do this, folks. My, my, my. I wasn't sure who we were tailing, but now I'm glad we did. So this is home sweet home, huh? Yep. Lean is gonna be so surprised. You keep talking about this lean person. Is she your sweetie? You've really got the wrong idea. I detect a whiff of defensiveness. Spill it, kiddo. She's my little sister. That's it? Ugh, boring. Well, maybe I'll just elbow in and tell her I'm your girl. <laughs> Don't you dare. Look at your face! Anyway, it really has been too long. I hope everyone's doing all right. The day I left for the watch, the village threw a big feast to wish me luck. Sounds like a nice community. It is. Now let's head in so I can introduce you to Lean. Is 
Hey, everybody! Noah's back! It's so good to see you! How's the watch? You must be the rising star! A real fighter! Just like your pa! Not quite. I'm still finding my wings. Aww, look how much they love you! And here we are. This is your house? A fine house. Noah! Noah, you're back! How are you? I've been worried sick. Hi, Aunt Martha. I'm good. Uh, but don't get too excited. I'm just here on assignment. Well, I'll take what I can get. Oh, I'm just tickled to see you. You look wonderful. Uh, thanks, Andy. It's so nice to meet you, ma'am. You might say I'm Noah's, uh, oh, what's the word? Well, let's just say, I occupy a special place in his life. You can call me Leon. What?! <gasps> uh, I mean, of course. <laughs> These things happen when a young man leaves the nest and so forth. Why didn't you tell me sooner, Noah? No, it's not like that. Leon's just being weird. Then why are you red as a beat, hmm? Oh, I can't wait to tell the whole village about my Noah, the lady killer. <laughs> wow. Thanks. I'm going to be untangling that mess for years. Let's just go find Lean. Lean? I'm back. Hmm. Is she not here? I mean, it's not like her to sit around at home, but... Uh-oh. I guess Lean's not home after all. I hope the runes aren't smiling on the luckiest girl alive again. <laughs> ah! Who are you? What do you want? What's going on?
Has something untoward occurred? What's happening? Come on! Who are you? Are you from the Watch? Something tells me you already know that. Who the hell are you, you piece of... He's giving me the creeps. What can I say? You've read me like a book. Now burn it all! What are you... Oh! Stop! <laughs> stop! Oh, but I can't do that! Let's hunt. the way out of the village. Yes, sir. Good. Forgive me, Master Erstwine, but is this truly the best village to target? If they come looking for the truth... All we need is for rumour to spread of an attack near the border. By the time they're through bickering over what happened where, the deed will be done. And besides... Yes? If a village must burn, where better than a place that fraternizes with tailed half-breeds? <laughs> Why? 
Why would someone do this? I don't know, man, but these are no ordinary bandits. So if we don't run right now, we're all gonna be worms food! I'm sorry, Dad. I'm sorry, Lean. Please be okay. Stay down if I were you. Oh, you gotta be kidding me! So damn tough. Just leave us alone already. Guess you got some more, huh? Don't let him escape. I am grateful for any opportunity to grow. This 
doesn't make any... Must clear the village. Do you think everyone got out? I don't know, but we've got to move. We gotta get out of here. I wouldn't go that way if I were you. Who's there? The village entrance is a trap. Come through the forest. <laughs> Says the man in imperial colors. Who I am and why I'm here can wait. Now, follow me, and quickly. I don't know if we can trust him, but we better decide real fast. Aren't you eager to see that old chatterbox? Martha. Uh. Let's go! Oh, thank goodness you're safe! Glad you made it, Noah. Is everyone all right? And where's Lean? If she's not here, I'm going back to... Easy, Noah. Lean is going to be just fine. Then why haven't I seen her? Because she left the village a week ago. <laughs> and in fine spirits, I might add. It said something about a grand adventure with her new best friend from the forest. Of course I tried to stop her. <laughs> but you know how that girl is. A grand adventure? Are you joking? <sighs> well, at least she's safe. Mm -hmm. And so are we, thanks to that gentleman and the young man with flaxen hair. Huh? You may call me Valentine, and while I appreciate the praise, all we did was respond to the situation as it unfolded. Ah. But here comes the lieutenant now. I did a quick sweep of the area. No one followed us. Sane? Is that you? This can't... N Noah! What are you doing out here? Hold on. You know the lieutenant. So that was your home. Ah, but it is a terrible thing. And you're saying you got sent to investigate the bandits, just like us? Correct. With Countess Groom's permission, of course. Only after we arrived did we start to question what it was we were actually investigating. Well, now that we've found the bad guys, let's team up and teach them what's what! They'll doubtless have withdrawn already. Besides, none of this adds up. What do you mean? The rumors circulating around the Empire say the Raiders are targeting Imperial villages. Wait, your lands? Maybe they're attacking the League and Empire both. I mean, 
They don't seem too bright. No. Because if you believe the rumors, the Raiders are the Eltisvice Watch. Wait, us? That's ridiculous! How dare you! Hey, easy. I'm just passing the rumor along, not confirming it. But I know deception when I smell it. Clearly something strange is afoot. And why are you dragging us into it, huh, buddy? Why do you keep insisting this is my fault? Well, we'd better return to Eltis Vice and fill the brass in. We'll report back as well. There are many dots that yet need connecting. You be careful out there, Noah! Stay healthy! Oh, and always boil your water before you drink it! Always do, Auntie. You'll keep an eye out for Lean? You just leave your sister to me. Next time she's home, I'll grab some rope and hog-tie her so tight she'll never get away. In the meantime, we've got some rebuilding to do. It's unlikely the raiders will return, but all the same, I advise you to wait before going back to the village. Noah's father would never forgive us if we abandoned our home. Thank you. All of you. Shall we be off? Safe travel, Sane. Oh, and you too, I guess. Safe travels to you, my lady. All right. Let's go. It was good to see you again, Sane. Noah. What? I can't help but worry that the next time we meet... ...we'll be on a battlefield. <sighs> You've got your path, Sane. You know what you want out of life, so just go for it, wherever it takes you. Yes, but... Meanwhile, I'll just keep meddling like I promised. For what it's worth, I don't think that will put us at odds. <sighs> so long, Sane. Hope you have some good stories ready for the next time we meet. So that's Noah, eh? Glad to finally meet the lad, considering how much you talk about him. Something tells me he's just the kind of friend you need. A friend. Let's just hope this premonition scratching at the back of our brains doesn't come to pass. Ah! 
I say it. I feel stronger. Bad idea. Raiders may be gone, sure, but we can't take any chances. Let's try to make good time. Let's hurry back home. this. Noah, glad I found you. Mimi, you're back, girl! Yes. There's been a summons. All members of the Watch have been recalled to Eltis Vice. Well, that sounds like official confirmation that bad things are happening. <sighs> Come on. This man in the hood sounds exactly like a rogue I crossed paths with. Who is he? I don't know. Though I thought it strange he attacked so brazenly. Mark me. He's in Duke's Eldrick's service. Not that he'd give up a shred of evidence if we caught him. So he's some kind of professional agitator? He sure knew all about the watch. He's creating a pretext for invasion. 
Huh? What? Who's invading? The Empire. They claim members of the Watch are violating their borders. But that's not true! They attacked us! The truth often means painfully little, especially in times of war. Would they really do that? I have sent Janquist to you, Chris, to request reinforcements, but they may not reach us in time. Your ladyship, we just received word that Vern Village has been occupied. And there we are. I see the Dukes as the grabby type when he covets a prize. Is everything I loathe in a man! Our defenses are being put in place exactly as you directed. Whether we resolve this by words or swords, we must first ascertain our opponent's mettle. Dispatch a reconnaissance team to Vern. Very well. Send me. I want to see this for myself. This is a mission of vital import. What say you, Lady Periel? Hmm. I'll allow it. After what transpired in his village, he deserves the chance. As you wish. The task is yours, oh fantastic and worthy captain. Go to Vern Village and report back once you've determined the size of the occupying forces. I won't fail you. Count me in too. You're not the only one with a bone to pick. Now then, choose your team. Oh, well, just say the word. We should depart for Vern Village as soon as everyone is ready. Vern is, uh, yeah, yeah, northwest of here. Follow the river west, then cross the bridge and bear north.
away. See you again. Aha! Good to see you. Do come again.
That didn't take long. Got the village buttoned up tighter than a skinflint's coin purse. So, where do we start? Could listen in on the soldiers. Could try and count their weapons and provisions. That tent in the back is worth a look, too. Don't be spotted. Halt! Who goes? No. Uh Not a nerve the League's got, stirring up trouble like this. What happened to their promises of friendship from that co-expedition? From what I hear, they want the rune barrows we found for themselves. That's why they're relocating everybody who lives in the area. Bunch of grubby bastards. I just hope they turn over those crooks from the watch so we can all go home. all killed? Please don't. Right there! Choo choo choo! What do we have here? Yeah, they're preparing to attack, and they ain't pissing around either. Provisions and weapons? Enough for a whole legion. They are serious. <sighs> so there is gonna be a war? Not if Lady Perio can help it, I imagine. But whatever happens, we follow orders. War with the Empire. Worry later. You want to try that big tent next?
Halt! Who got Shoot, shoot! Stop! Right there! No. Psst! Over there! Are the preparations complete? Nearly, sir. We'll break this insignificant country and serve it to the dukes on a platter. My cap needs a finer feather after all. That's gotta be the commander here. Though it sounds like he reports up to somebody else. Security looks tight. Best stay clear. I guess we hit the tent in the back and then we're done? Really? The guard just left his post. I know, right? Sloppy. He's gonna catch it when he gets back. Come on, don't stop there. There's no going back this way. Pretty lady, you gonna make some noise for me? That's a good girl. Yes, you are, Sylvie. That Byronic lens reactor of yours is ready to pump out 500 poles of pressure. A heart that big deserves to be loved back. But first, we need to get you all gussied up. Oh, I love you, Sylvie. You're my special lady. What the heck? Ah! Who, who are you? You didn't, um, I don't know, hear any of that? Hear any of what? 
I was just giving my lady... I mean, I was talking to the... Well, not like conversing, but verbally running checks on this inanimate thing. Uh, great, I guess. Do I know you? You're not with the army. <sighs> Good thing, too. They'd never let me live this down. I take it you're not a soldier. Nuh-uh. I'm more of an engineer. See? Jukes Aldrick wants to improve on her rune lenses work. They're too fickle and magical, and they're also tied to specific wielders with unpredictable potency. He's looking to develop technology that lets everyone wield them equally. Who's there? You! Wait, Hildy? <sighs> Pole, sound the alarm. Yes, Mom! Well, crap. Don't let the intruders escape! Go, Noah! Now! But... Uh, right. Um... Who was that, Mom? <sighs> the enemy. Hildy do that? I, I thought we were buds. Shut your mouth and move already. said yes. What would you do about that, eh? Any last words? <laughs> what? Sullying my blade. Training is the friend that never betrays you. Gotta say, this could really be going a lot better. Wrong way. Way out of here unless we bust through. We bust you now, League scum. Time to swat some flies. 
Been at this a long time, Imp. It ain't gonna be the likes of you that'll do me in. Big mistake. Try me. Okie doke. Stronger next time. Training is the friend that never betrays you. Monsters. You're the ones ravaging our villages. No, we... Sorry, brother. Nothing we say is gonna make this right for either of us. Let's move. Right. Stop them! I won't learn anything from you. Come on! Amir's waiting for our report. War... I can't believe it. Well-timed, oh great captain. I was just about to report to her ladyship. You can accompany me. Sure. All right. S 
So, they have enough weaponry to arm a legion, as well as several months of provisions. Hard to imagine this chapel fellow in command needs that many men just to take some so-called raiders into custody. We've received information that Dukes Aldric and his army are en route to Norsferia to requisition the Empire's newly annexed territory. As for the reinforcements we requested, opinions in Eucharist are divided. The Chamber of Lords in particular is reticent to be dragged into what they view as a problem between Altisvice and the Empire. It doesn't help that a tidy sum is riding on the Norsefarian purchase, and the Lords are fearful the deal will fall through. King Yuma Sheareth, for his part, is amenable to providing troops, but the Lords have spooked him into inaction for now. That sounds like Yuma. Blast it. I should have foreseen the money issue. If that was part of the Dukes' hand, he's even craftier than I thought. Well, I didn't expect help to come right away, so at least there's a sliver of hope. Mm, sounds like we'll be hunkering down here for a few months until Eucharis comes around. Won't be easy. I did as her ladyship asked, and augmented Eltis Vice's food stores. We have enough for a year. Thankfully. Time is on our side. The longer the war, the harder it will be for those noble dolts to feign blindness to the enemy's ambitions. So there it is. We fend off the Empire's first attack, then weather the long siege. I'm counting on you all. We won't let you down. Hmm. Noah, was it? Emir, give him command of a unit. What? My lady, just because Gar trusted the boy with temporary captainship of a very small company is no... He's clearly eager for more, and I'm sure Gar and the others will mentor him. Isn't that right? I've always been good at showing folks the ropes. Good. Because wars are shaped by the right narrative. So the story goes something like this, perhaps. Though the boy's home was raised by the cowardly Empire, he found the courage to take up arms in the face of despair. That'll work. Make sure it's the talk of every tavern and hall by the end of the week. Oh, I suppose raised is an exaggeration. An embellishment. Milady, if I may. Yes, Jenquis. What is it? You look haggard. Yes, well, fighting for your life will do that to a woman.
I was just about to come find you. They're holding a war council. It's happening. So this is it, huh? It's been a long two weeks. This will be your first big battle, right? Come on, let's go see what Gar and the others are up to. There's Noah. Our scouts report the Imperial Army is on the march. I need all troops in defensive positions. You are ready, I presume. Yep. Good to go. We'll win today. No matter what. Heck yeah! I like the confidence, but keep your heads out of the clouds. We're looking at a long battle here. <sighs> Don't stand a chance. Come on. Defend your positions at all costs and step lively. Though we face just the one legion, sloppiness will still get you killed. We gotta stop those damn imps here and now. Don't let them set one foot inside the walls. Got it. There it is. The tiny nation that dared bear its fangs at the Empire. But even the runt of the litter must be brought to heel. Galdeans! Advance! Fight bravely. All of you. In the name of her ladyship! not pass. Yeah, what he said!
apologies. We were delayed. Sorry. He was... I mean... The rune tank was having a bad morning. <laughs> About time the Kessling boy arrived. Though the Duke's favours him, he will stay out of my way if he holds even a lick of sense in his head. for every one of your pathetic lies. Attack! You chose to harbor the criminals who raided our lands. We've every right to seek justice. Reading. A healing light to ease off. All right, they seem to be pulling back. Lieutenant, are you...? I'm fine. Get ready. You're my quarry now! There's no escape!
conclusion. Stay alert and continue the advance. Tell the troops, I'm ordering a retreat. Why do these insects simply refuse to be squashed? Too bad for you. We're the most stubborn pack of fighters you'll ever face. We just need to hold out a little longer. Fight for our friends, our families, and our homes. And you will never break us! No! Of all the fool... General Chapel, sir. We... Uh... I know, damn you! Fine. We'll regroup and crush them later. Maybe in another lifetime. We did it! The enemy is retreating! Well now, I'd say we've all earned a spot of rest. And with that, the trap is sprung. What? No, it can't be! Impossible. War isn't about soldiers scrabbling at each other trying to draw blood. War is breaking your enemy's spirit. Watching their eyes widen like frightened hares before a wolf. Bringing the meek to bay. He marched his entire army from Norsfaria? But none of our intelligence gave the slightest indication of... And an enemy's heart is never more vulnerable than in the moment they believe victory is at hand. That is when you reveal your greatest weapons. Overwhelming numbers and fear. Go forth, Galdeans. March as if none stand in your way. Become fear itself. This can't be happening. <sighs> Damn it. to safety! Picar! Warriors don't die like dogs! They pick themselves up off the ground and they damn well survive! <sighs> You're right. Other soldiers are regrouping at her ladyship's manor.
Take control of the town, and do try not to embarrass me in front of the dukes. Yes, sir! Quickly! You all made it. Where's Emir? Inside. How's, how's it looking out there? They're, they're closing at speed. Whatever we're doing, we, we better do it fast. Milady, we must get you out of here. Do something! Protect her! I, I agree. There's no time to lose. We'll gather the remaining soldiers. And then take everyone and escape through the East Gate. What are you saying? You're coming with us, my lady. Aren't you? No, no, I'm not. H however, the distraction you create is going to help me escape. There's a secret passage by the manor that leads to safety. One of House Groom's little insurance policies. I'll use that while you make for the exit. But, but, we should decide where we'll regroup, because I haven't even begun to fight. A secret passage, is it? Well, how about that? Oh, 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 I know! We should meet at that ruined castle we found! That's perfect. There's no way the imps will be able to squeeze all their men through that mine. Good. Then, then it's decided. Mm -hmm. Very, very good. Then we'll meet you there once we make our escape. Your, your ladyship, you, you take Jane Quist and... Uh, let's see. If you need a bodyguard, I am. Oh, nope. This job's mine. I, I'm a strict follower of the mercenary creed, which is to stick with the person least likely to get murdered. You're not gonna make me break my creed, are ya? Wow, that's convenient. Uh, just take, take care of her. If that's settled, it's time to go. Good luck, my lady. I'll travel safe. You too, Emir. Uh, Noah. Might we speak privately for a moment? Wait, me? I know time is short, but I would beg a boon of you. Uh, that's like a f favor, right? In the offhand chance. No, in the one in a thousand chance I don't make it out of here alive, I want you to raise an army in my place. You want me to lead the resistance? No, because in 999 possible futures, I'm doing that. 
only asking you to cover the one slim possibility that remains. Will you do it? Okay, but, but why want me? I had the privilege of observing many people as I grew up. And what I came to learn is that most people in this world cannot be trusted. However, there are exceptions. Not many, and they are difficult to find, but... There are trustworthy people out there all the same. I I'm asking because I think you're one of them. Also, you remind me just a bit of someone I once loved. Uh huh. Now, be gone with you. You're supposed to be my distraction, so get out there and start distracting. Yeah, mule. Okay, okay, I'm going. And I promise I won't let you down. Good, good luck, Noah. The Chatterbox returns! So, how was your talk? Where to begin? He can tell us later. Noah, I want you to take the vanguard. Break through and open the gate.
move, move. Move faster. The town is nearly in our grasp. General, the enemy stragglers are making a break for the east gate. Hmm. But that's where the Kessling boy is posted, isn't it? Yes, sir. And Lieutenant Kessling has asked us to send more troops. No nonsense. He, he can make do without. Begging your pardon, General. But, but his unit is just a few soldiers and the rune tank. From what I hear, the Duke's views Saint Kessling as a singular talent. So what, pray tell, does the Wonderkind have to fear from a few League stragglers? Have faith in the lad. Reinforcements will be coming. All, all alone? Well, that's fantastic. The thing, the thing is, sir, in General Chapel, he, he... You don't have to explain that man to me. Oh, oh. get the room tank running. You use, use it as a barricade. Right. Thank you. 
you've seen. What I've seen. You, you, you know this war is unjust. I do. How am I my place is in the Imperial Army? Army. My, my house's responsibilities now fall to me. Look, look. I've got ambitions. I understand that. My, my situation has changed. And I have to leave through that gate. Lieutenant! Stand down. Please. I cannot! You need only lay down your weapon! No, no. I made a promise. Duty as an Imperial soldier is clear. Get ready, Noah. I am ready. Is that all? My my turn. I might pass as not end here. Is he holding back? I'm not letting you stop us. Surrender, Noah. This war is already over. Like hell it is. If you, you continue to resist, I will, I will have to hurt you. That doesn't mean anything. Very well. Have it your way. Watch by my prince and bend to yours. Your way. Why should my principles bend to yours? Surrender! I swear on my house's honor that you and your friends will be spared. Not, not happening, Saint. You're, you're gonna be stubborn about it. Secret passage. You're the distraction. You did it to save everyone else. Then, then I ask again. Why are you here? You, you could have 
treated us like pawns, but, but you never did. That, that kind of loyalty deserves to be paid in equal coin. Besides, you look like a lady with one last trick up her sleeve. We meet, we meet again, Miss Groom. I don't recall seeing you on, you on my calendar, Your Grace. <laughs> Ever proud, aren't we? I thought, I thought we might, might take this moment to discuss our future relationship. Are you, Are you about, about to propose, propose you cad? <laughs> Sadly, I, I am already, already married. However, if you are willing to reassess our other relationship, I will permit you to keep your status, your wealth, and this manner. A generous proposal, don't you think? To join the Empire. To join you. What, what happens to the other lead states? Their er, age has concluded. What, what concern is it of yours? I see you for the brilliant mind you are. Swear the beauty to me, and the entire league will be yours. Talking. My, my offer pleases you. Oh, oh it's very, very bold. bold. And, and it makes, makes my skin crawl. crawl. A, a life of luxury, luxury beneath your, your heel? heel? I'd so sooner get down in the mud with the other soldiers, soldiers and fight you to my, my dying breath. breath. How dare you speak to his grace that way? Enough, Chapel. You, 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 you my, my honor, honor, young lady. A fine jest to speak of on honor. The, the Emperor of Baldia still draws, draws breath. breath. You, you carry your yourself as if what it is is yours. <laughs> that, that is his one. Excuse me. I believe we're done, done here. here. You, you cheeky. <laughs> <laughs> oh, but, but you are a fiery young woman. To choose singing in some barracks instead of the Empire's finest silks. Show, show Miss Perry Alligator Gates. And, and if, if any man lays a hand on her, I'll, I'll have his head parted from his shoulders. shoulders. I can see myself out. Uh, uh, my lady. Your, your grace. How can you... Just, just a, a woman and an old man. They pose no threat. Mark, Mark me well, well Dukes. The, the day, day will come, come when this woman, woman erases, erases the triumph, triumph from, from your face. That... that. Is a promise. Until, Until then, I, I bid you farewell.
can we guide the surviving soldiers back from the mines? There were a few stragglers lost in the tunnels, but I don't, I don't think we missed anyone. Good, good work. But where's, where's their ladyship? You don't, you don't gotta worry about a tough piece of leather, leather like her. Besides, the beans are there, there to keep her safe. were sadly accurate. We need, we need no, no further, further confirmation of Duke's Aldrich territorial designs than the army he commands. Okay, but the other nations of the League are gonna help us, right? 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 It, it is pretty to think so. But, but the Duke is a crafty man, and he, and he may attempt to frame, frame the war as a limited dispute between, between the Empire and if he is successful, our, our allies may, may hesitate. Ha ha ha, They ain't gonna stand, stand up to Gaudia until the fires, until the fires of war are burning on their doorstep. They'll pretend, pretend not to hear, while the Empire, Empire sharpens, sharpens its knives and prepares to take another slice of the continent. continent. Army? Yeah, cousin, let's do it. We can't let those infirmer march, march around our home like they own the place. So there's, there's a chance we can get it back. <sighs> what do you, you want to be, kid? Asked it of you, that, that don't, don't mean you're obligated. obligated. Uh -huh. I already, I already promised, promised her. You sure about sure this? It? Yes. Well, well, that, that, that is, is her ladyship's wish. I, I won't object. Let's go, go raise, raise an, an army. army. Let's be clear. 
no one no is in command, command on a provisional basis, basis only, only until their ladyship, ladyship returns. Very good. Still, Still these, these ruins, ruins will require a serious, serious work for going, going to station an army here. What took you so long, cousin? You're our leader, remember? No sleeping in. Provisional leader. Just until her ladyship returns. Yeah, well, I think he's doing great. Yeah, <laughs> poor Noah. You got a lot of folks to please. For the past week, I tasked all of you with converting these ruins into an acceptable headquarters. However, there is still much to be done. Oh, please, no more physical labor. I'm so much better at flexing my mind. At least the soldiers have a place to sleep now. Ah, uh, it won't be as fancy as my inn back in Elda's Vice, but I'll make sure everyone gets decent meals. And I'm still combing the mines for any soldiers we missed. If I may, there are a few people I'd like to introduce. The name's Gakto. Emir expressed interest in building a town here. And when I smell profit... Ah... Uh, I mean, when I smell justice against an oppressive empire, then I say, sign me up. Just so happens I'm well salted in the art of stewardship. 
Anyway, one long-term goal is to set up a local guild. I'll keep you posted. I am Iris, an architect and former professor at the University of Carl, who has long dreamt of designing a town of my own. Much to my delight, Emir reached out and has given me the chance to put my skills to use on your behalf. If you find yourself in need of a new building, I am your lady. The University of Carl? Very impressive, Miss Iris. Hello, I'm Kane. Gokto introduced me. I manage your warehouse. If we want our new town to flourish, we'll need countless resources and a place to stash them. That's where I come in. to look after a whole town's resources. You mind taking me on as an apprentice? Certainly, young lady. There's a lot to learn, but you look like you can keep up. Thank you all. Yet while we've achieved the bare minimum of infrastructure, we must strive for more. It's not just the facilities that are lacking. We need people. Call ourselves an army if it's just nine folks and a couple of pitchforks. I've been nosing around Eltisvice and the neighboring villages. Imps are still there, but their patrols are getting sloppy. We might be able to do some recruiting. Then let's hop to it! Bigger headquarters, more comrades, onward and upward! But if you don't mind me adding to the pile, cousin, there's one more matter you gotta tend to. Dare I even ask? It's fine. What is it? You gotta name this castle. Can't keep calling it the ruins or the castle or whatnot. That ain't gonna impress no one. Now that's an idea I can get behind. Think carefully, man. This is one of those watershed moment dealies. A name for the castle, is it? Very well. Dazzle me with your creativity. Inclined to agree. Flawless execution, cousin. Well, I suppose that is a name of sorts. Now then, if we are to stage an actual resistance, we must grow our numbers. An army is only as strong as its people, after all. Going forward, you should seek out as many new comrades as possible. And you might not have to go far to find them. We'll give it our best, right everyone? 